Hey folks, this is Mustafa Arjan from Radar. In this video, I will try to explain how you can create and publish a content from anywhere on the web by using our brand new Chrome extension, which is called Publish with Radar. But before that, if it's your first time at here, please don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel so you can get notified when we publish new product training video. So, if you are ready, let's jump over to Google and check all detail about Publish with Radar Chrome extension. To install Publish with Radar extension, just go to uh, google.com and search for Chrome Web Store and click the first link to reach the uh, Chrome Web Store and search for Radar over here and find the Publish with Radar extension. Click on it and then click to add to Chrome button and uh, click to add extension uh, to confirm that and uh, publish with Radar extension will be installed on your uh, Chrome browser. If you like, you can pin this uh, extension to your toolbar to reach it uh, very easily. Uh, after this point, you can start to use this extension uh, and when you find an content over uh, um, over the web, you will able to see publish uh, with radar button, which is located right button. Also, you can click the uh, extension icon via your toolbar to open it. When you open it first time, uh, you need to sign in with your radar uh, account. Uh, if you don't have an account, you can easily sign up for a new one. Right now, I'm signing with my Radar account. Yes, and Publish with Radar interface will uh, appear. Uh, if you have multiple subscription over Radar, uh, be sure that you selected the right one. Then you can select the publishing date, uh, its uh, current date uh, as default. Uh, you can change it. Uh, for example, I'm choosing next Monday and uh, 10 a.m. Um, let's say. Uh, it means you will schedule this content for this date. Right now I'm setting it to current date because I want to publish it directly. Then you can select your social media profiles which you want to publish this content. You can select one by one or you can use the categories feature to select a group of your social media profiles. And you can make uh, some changes uh, over the title of this content or the description, caption of this content. For example, I'm adding an emoji to here. And uh, right now we are ready. You can save this content as a draft uh, into your scheduler or you can simply click the publish now button to start the publishing process. Uh, when you click the uh, publish now button, your post will be created over your radar scheduler and you can click the view button to uh, watch the process. And when you click the view button, uh, you will redirect the, your uh, related um, subscription scheduler feature. And as you can see, the process uh, already started and the content will be published in uh, seconds to your selected social media profiles. Uh, also, uh, if you like, uh, you can select uh, a specific part of uh, that content, for example, this part, and you can right click on it uh, and you can choose the publish now button. It means right now uh, publish with radar uh, extension will prepare your content with this selected text. And uh, this time you can add this content to your content pool to publish it later and yeah and just click the save as button or just click the save as approved button to save it to your content pool 
Uh, also, uh, you can uh, select a specific image uh, from that content, for example, this one. And when you come over that image, uh, a publish with radar button will appear on it. And if you click this button, uh, publish with radar extension uh, will fetch that image for your content. You can still make some changes and you can uh, publish it directly via scheduler feature or you can add it to uh, content pool, your content pool. Yeah, that's all about publish with radar Chrome extension. I hope you enjoyed with this video and I hope you can take benefit of this extension. Thank you for watching, take care, bye bye.